Greetings, Auto Subs. Video James, and we're back with Lego Jurassic World. Um, last time we left off, I forget where we were exactly in Jurassic Park, but we're gonna go back there today. But before we do that, I found a little secret secret. So if we go up here, I don't know why I said secret secret, because secret twice is redundant. But if we go up here, and then we talk to the shop people. No, talk to the shop people. There we go. Come on. There we go. So if we talk to the shop people, and then we hit the back button, and it's the first time we do that, we'll actually get a free refund. Okay, I'm down on heart, so I need to stop doing that. I just love jumping off the ledge because he acts like Iron Man. Because he does that kind of superhero landing. Oh, it's really killer on his knees, and obviously his heart. Okay, so we're here. So I think we might be right before the T-Rex paddock. But don't quote me on that because I have absolutely no clue. Um, there's a flare right here. Can I pick this up? No. Uh, what are you? You're the Lego kit thing. Okay, it's been a while since I played this, so I kind of got to recollect myself, re-get my bearings. Um, you don't do anything. I can probably break you if I had a T-Rex. Oh, yeah, I got to go in here. There we go. Okay, T-Rex enclosure. Wait. Um, what were you? Triceratops recovery. Yeah, so we're at T-Rex enclosure. So we're literally right at the T-Rex. My guy. I finally get to relive my favorite scene from Jurassic Park. This is literally my favorite scene from Jurassic Park. Right before the scene where the T-Rex is actually saving the people. Screw you, Dennis. And here it is, the famous steel scene. I love how they just shoved them into a shaving cream container. And the T-Rex paddock. I love how he knows this technology stuff, but this guy is able to just know... Or I love how... That guy, who's at the computers right now, knows all this technology stuff, but they had to hire a dentist. Like, why? It, that's a good point. I always assume I touch something when something happens, too. Here it is. Oh, come on. You couldn't have shown the goat leg? That's Horse Hawk. And there it is, the famous line. Here we go, snapping cables. Come on, please do the roar. Please do the roar. Turn off the light, you idiot. I mean... Yeah, of course, that's what you do when you see a giant dinosaur. You just shine a light brightly in his face over and over again. I'm trying to eat the car. There it is. I love the T-Rex roar. T-Rex roar is just absolutely my favorite roar. I love it. Because it's got such a unique sound to it. Okay, um, can you go that way? Yes. Alright, so I'm going to actually break stuff again. Just because you guys know I love getting that true survivor bonus. Plus, if there's secrets, and I'll find them. Break. Break. Because I'm about to break. And coiny coins. Although, for some reason, these are Lego studs. Like, I don't know why they're called studs. Because they don't look very handsome to me. Uh, break that. There we go. And then there's a carrot. What is carrot significance? Oh, no. I need the, um... I need the botanist lady. Uh, I forget her name. I need... I need Alan Grant's girlfriend, the botanist lady. There's a rat over here. Can I punch it? Nope. Oh, come on. I want to punch the rat. That's always the best thing to do in LEGO games, is just find the little mouse character, like in the original LEGO Star Wars, the complete trilogy, how they had the little mouse droids. You just go around and blow them up, and then they just regenerate. Because they're always just so fun and so cute to take out. The tree is dead. I'm like the opposite of the Lorax right now. Can I break this? Um, no, and I can't interact with it. What happens if I switch? Uh, there we go. 
Ian Malcolm, what can you do? Nothing. Okay. I hope they just have that permanent scared face. He can't pick that up either. Okay, great. Apparently Grant's more useful than you. Okay, the T-Rex is right there. No, go this way. Break this. Apparently the T-Rex is only interested in the car. Ah, he's only interested in the car right now, I say. Okay, so I need to go this way. Um, is there anything else I can get? There's a spider right here. Or a beetle or something. But I don't think I can get... Oh, I can get around him. Okay. So that's something. No, move. Move, you little button. Okay, what are you? No, can I use Grant for that? Or do I have to use the Ellie? I remember her name now. No, he won't go near that either. Okay. Grant can actually take out these plants, though. I remember that. Grant can actually take out the plants. Hey, that nearly rhymed. Okay. There's a thing over here. But I need a piece for it. This way. There we go. And drain that and we get the sign for the paddock. Now what's that going to build? I always love how the Lego stuff is just like so creative. There we go. Now what do you do? Come on. There you go. Um, okay, it's another circle thing. Okay, that is cute. It's like a little music box with a Jurassic Park thing. Good job, Ian. Get him. And he gets the bone. And then I can go dig him out with Grant. Nice! Okay, Grant, let's go. Hurry before he gets that broken. I mean, I'm assuming he'll break it in the next five seconds, so we gotta go. Okay, come on. There we go. Come on, get out, kids. We need to get away from this thing. Alright, I got you, girl. Um, okay, hold this. No! Okay, not hold. Tap, 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 tap. And we got her. Perfect. Ah, crap, the T-Rex is back. I'm pretty sure the other kid is dead. With how much that car is smushed, I'm pretty sure the other kid is dead. Some characters, such as Lex Murphy, can scream and Blake glass Lego objects. Oh, so I gotta use like a screen. That's a good scream. And then he gets distracted. Yep. I want to unlock the T-Rex so bad. Just because it's got such destructive power. Although he is very stupid. And Malcolm finds the flare. Uh, yeah, that would be a good idea. I would say. And I get the true survivor bonus. My guy. Okay. What do I need to do? Um. Okay, tap. Tap like a maniac. Because she is a maniac. Oh, it's a winch. I thought it was like a wind-up lever or something. Okay, um, I'm pretty sure I'm going to need Grant for this, because kids can't drive. There we go. And then I can just take this and jump over here. And get in the car, maybe? Come on. Got to be a way to do this. There we go. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure he'd just get more deadified if he did that. We did, like, no improvements whatsoever. Okay, tap, 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 tap. I almost lost it again. Here we go, another cutscene. Where'd she get the chainsaw? Oh, crap. They're going to have to jump, aren't they? 
Yep. And there goes the car. Yeah, dude, not on the camera. Come on. I mean, what the camera ever do to you? All right. We got the true survivor and we got a trophy. Yeah. Okay, so continue. Level complete. True survivor. Fossil piece A. Collect the fifth Triceratops fossil piece. I love, I absolutely love this game. It's just like a mini movie. Dude, close the shirt. This boy. My guy. Yeah, I would chance getting away from that place as fast as possible. And there we go. Car chase? Oh, please tell me car chase. Yes. Um. Wait, what did it say to use the flares for? Ah, uh, crap. I don't know what it said to use the flares for. Um, what am I doing? Am I just running from the T-Rex? Because that I can do. I'm just repeatedly pressing the flare button. Uh, there's more blue coins. Crap, I'm missing everything. I'm probably going to go back and redo this level after I record this video, but I don't know. This T-Rex is getting dangerously close. I don't like it. Thank you. And then get these. There we go. And True Survivor is extremely low for this level. Probably not. Oh, hello. There he is. That was not cool, Mr. T-Rex. Okay, how far over can I actually go? Not that far over. How am I keeping this speed right now? Am I just... Does it, like, not matter what I do? Well, I think it at least doesn't matter if I push the flare button right now. Because the flares don't really seem to be doing anything to them. Oh, never mind. There we go. Wait, did we do it already? That was not the entire level. This guy... But that's going to free all the dinos. Yeah, just just do it, dude. It's okay. Look, see that? It's on. It works. The shutdown drip the circuit breaker. I see that. Three minutes, I can have power back on in the entire park. What about the dinos that already got out, though? Okay. Um, I'll probably play this back in my other time. Just because I did not get the true survivor. Return to hub. Okay. So I'm guessing that means we just progress onward now. Hey, Gallimimus. Er, is that Gallimimus? Yeah. Gallimimus is the big dudes. The big chicken looking guys. Tiny Murphy, or Timmy Murphy, can access small gaps such as these to sneak around and find other areas of the park. So, can the girl? No, I don't think so. The girl's bigger than him in the movie, isn't she? So I don't think she'll actually be able to... Oh, we can actually use him. Okay. I didn't know we could use him. I thought he was still stuck in the car. Okay, so now I shall convert back into Alan Grant. Roll out. There we go. So now I dig up whatever this is and then go over and break the ladder. Oh, this is the hub. So I don't even need to break the ladder. I can just build this and be done. Yeah, sorry, kid. You're staying here. I ain't bringing you with me, no dinosaur. There we go. Okay. The raptor pack. Wait, the raptors already? But weren't we, like, just at the T-Rex? Raptors didn't happen until way later. Collect the first T-Rex fossil piece. Ooh, T-Rex piece. I want it. Yeah, you're going to need some guns. 
I was about to say, if he got that excited over a fish. There it is. This, this is the most famous scene from Jurassic Park. Well, one of the most famous scenes from Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park was such a well-known movie just because it was such a masterpiece. Okay, so everything's turning on. Oh, there it is. Wait, is he alive? Veloc Raptor. There's a target up there. I think that guy can shoot. But I want to break everything down here first. Just because I feel as if they will yield some sort of result. Yes, they gave us tracks. So, before we do that... There we go. And then I got an egg. Or a nest or something. Alright, so give me this, and then I'll track the raptor. I'm pretty sure it went this way. I mean, I just saw the tail going in the bushes. Oh, but he dropped something. There we go, and then Plant Lady can take care of that. You just carry around a watering can with you? Like, who just carries around, like, a full-size watering can? Oh, doesn't matter, because we got jumpy pads. Can we make it? Okay, so this isn't like regular Lego games where you have to like move the controls to kind of get enough momentum. No, go that way. There we go. Why don't you go backwards? Um, just break everything. Just to get the true survivor. That's my main goal in like every Lego game when I first start out is just immediately get the true survivor. Just so that when the end game comes, I can have all the coins that I need to actually be able to get the end game stuff, like the dinosaurs and all that for this game. Okay, she waters the plant and makes a ladder, I'm assuming. Yep. Alright, come on, dude. We need to go this way. Actually, I need you up here right now. Where are you? Uh, point. And then... Nope, I missed the vine. I miss the age of vines. I mean, come on, don't you know? Vines are dead by now, so why is this one still here? You come on, too. Come on, Ellie, we gotta, we gotta help Nameless Guy. I forget his name. Yes, run very fast. Even though, for some reason, he's walking very slowly. Get him off, get him off, get him off! He just straight decked him in the face. I'm pretty sure a raptor wouldn't give up that easy. So, I would still be running if I were you. But that's like cool little mini game. Alright, get this. There's another egg thing up there. Two out of four. What happens if I get all four? Also, it's cool how in this game, instead of having the traditional like 10 mini kits to get some sort of super brick or something, that they just gave you the one mini kit. And the fossil pieces, and that lets you unlock the dinosaurs. Okay, get up there. Um, Ellie, you want to take care of that? Thanks. Jump in. I still honestly can't believe the fact that they made that in animation for this game. Find anything good in there? Find any good yum nums? Okay, build this. And we get ourselves a bridge. But I... Want le coins. Okay, good thing it has path direction, because if I tried walking this with the Kindle controls, I would be le screwed. Uh, dude, you coming? Yeah, he's just really slow. Also, I think there's a raptor somewhere around here, because she is moving exceedingly slow. Alright. Switch into this guy. And then he can just shoot that. Can I get the... Um, egg over there. Nope, but I can get attacked by a raptor. Get off me. Okay, uh, wrench thingy. Also, is that a wrench or like a symbol for their arm? Because the Lego people have those claw hands. And that looks like a claw on a 
sort of a sort of lever shaped object. So I'm wondering if it might not be like a hand, like a symbol of their hand. Okay, there we go. True survivor. I can stop trying now. Four out of four. And I got a fossil piece. Nice. Okay, what are you? You're a tracking thing. So I can track whatever you are. Yeah, it's a butterfly. But I can track these guys. Oh, hello. They're back. Am I going to have to fight these things off? Like, am I literally going to have to fight off three Velociraptors? There were three in the movie, weren't they? Or was it four? Okay, break this. Oh, he's over here now. Wait, what? Um. There he goes. So do I have to shoot him? Or her? I forgot all the dinosaurs in Jurassic Park are female. So I have to shoot her. Alright, so he goes in that one. Um. Crap, what one are they in? Uh, that one. Got him! Got him! Okay, they woke up. So, apparently the leaf rustling. Okay, middle, right, middle, left, middle, right, middle, middle. There we go. I might not even have to fight him. I might just be able to take out all three of the raptors right now. Unless it's just one of them. Because the other one's down in the place. Okay, so that way, that way, that way, that way, that way, that way, that way. Okay, this one. Daddy! Okay, he sh she should be down now. Because the heart is empty. Yeah, run, girl. This man is a gun god. I love that. That was the my favorite thing from the trailer when I saw that was that banana gun scene. I, I love that so much. Alright. Why is like the brightness turned all the way down? It isn't. Okay. Well, for some reason, the brightness just got kicked in the nuts. Uh, continue. Level complete. So we're in kitchen escape now. Why are we progressing this fast? We're, like, almost already over with Jurassic Park. Okay. We have to find the others. Back soon. I promise. Okay. So what do we get? Free food. What are they doing? Yeah, and you just smeared yourself with sausage juice. Not exactly the smartest idea. Okay, there's going to be a level after this. I can tell. I can already tell there's going to be a level after this, just from how this is getting set up. I love that moment where she's just surprised, like, wait, what does that mean? That would be such a good thing if that was a quote in the movie, just like, it's a Velociraptor. <gasps> what does that mean? <laughs> okay, there's two of them in here right now. Boy, they heard that. They gonna hear you and eat you in two seconds. Also, there's an octopus on that. Oh, hello, raptor. Nice to see you. Thanks for coming out. Uh, wait, there's an area here. Or should be somewhere. There's a target right there. Um, what can I do? Lex Murphy can use her baseball to hit Lego targets. Okay. I was confused for a second, like, wait, what do I do? Hey, buddy boy, there's some sausages there for you. Or buddy girl, I guess. That's a lot of sausage, though. Should be like a full pig. Okay, come on. Come on, um... Whatever your name is, little brother, I forget. But... Um... Okay, I can't move this. And punching it does nothing. 
which means there has to be something. Okay, this is a job for the little guy. There's always a job out there for the little guy somewhere. Okay, climbs in that, and climbs out of this. And now the raptor's over there. Terrific! So now I have to avoid this raptor. Um, can I do anything with you? Yes. And then I can get back over here and have the girl throw the baseball at that. So just nonchalantly aim this over here. Or not so nonchalantly. Okay, slowly. It's hard to do because this aim on this system is super buggy. Okay, she doesn't want to throw it at it for some reason. Come on, throw the baseball. It comes back anyway. Or not because you don't want to even throw it. Okay, I need to wait for like the little red rings to appear. Come on, get in there. No, I have to be at a distance to be able to throw it at it. But the reticle has to be on the item. And the controls for the reticle are super... Well, don't get in the way of the baseball. I mean, I'm trying to save our lives here. Trying to save us from eating, from being eaten by velociraptors. And you're getting in the way of my friggin' baseball. Okay, you have the worst aim of any character I've ever seen. There we go. I had to hit that at like an exact angle to where it was almost impossible unless you were like clear up against the other thing. Like this would have to have been showing for you to actually been able to do that. Um, can I pull this? No, I can't pull this. Okay. So maybe I need the little guy again. Yes. And then he can just sneak around. And he can't move that because it's way too heavy. I mean, that is a big trolley. Uh, there's something over here. Uh, locked character. Great. Meaning I can't do that. So I would need girl character over here to be able to actually get that. Oh, crap. He hurt us. She hurt us. I keep forgetting she... I keep forgetting all the dinosaurs in Jurassic Park are female. And he's got his head stuck in the pot. Can't blame him though, my dog does that exact same thing. Okay, can you move? I mean, there's raptors in here, we need to not die. Which means efficient pace, young one. Oh great, now they're gonna hear that. Really, they didn't hear that? I would think that out of anything, like the sound of a giant, um, sound of a giant thing falling down and crashing open on the floor would be the one thing that these velociraptors would hear. There we go. Wow, that was annoying. The character literally moved in front of the grate so that I couldn't get in. Wow, that's annoying. Okay, so we're over here now. Oh crap, the ladle. Yeah, see, how is that what they heard? Oh, they're getting smarter. So now I can push them with the trolley. I'm hoping. What is this? I'm not Ian Malcolm, so I can't do that. What is that, like a physics board or something? Okay, but there is a doodad of coins over here. So what else is there? Can I break this? Ow, okay. So don't break that. And then girl character can come over here. Maybe. There we go. Girl character, come over here. No, wrong one. Um, It's the third one. Yes. Alright, so you come down here. And then we can sneak out because they are a dum-dum and they don't notice us. Weren't you just up on the counter a second ago? Okay, I can't get this. 
What was that I needed to get? I think I needed to get something over here. Oh, right. The, um, the screwed up baseball angle thingy. Okay, that they had to have heard. I'm sorry I'm just kind of crapping on the game for its lack of hearingness, but, I mean, come on. The noises that these things should hear should be relevantly obvious. And I've opened the freezer. I remember this scene. Okay, so I need you. Boy, why'd you get back there? No. I don't know why they're all, like, moving on their own, either. Like, the raptors can't really get to you unless they see where you're at. Yeah, see, the lady just went back there. Why? Okay, so I go over here and do something with this block. Oh, he's got night vision. Okay. So he kept the goggles. But I can't break that. Okay, so build this into whatever sort of contraption. Looks like a giant toilet. I'm not going to lie. Looks like a giant toilet. But we just made something. What was it? Like a meat-flavored ice cream thing? Oh, wait. There's a thingy here. There we go. And then... A curse bluey. Really? I have to break this more than once? There we go. And all it gave me was studs. Oh, we're getting closer to the true survivor bonus. Uh-oh. Okay, so they can do that now. That is not nice. Can I just keep moving and they won't see me? Hello. Hi there. Your eyes are on the side of your head, so you should be able to see me. But for some reason, you're not. Because logic? No, it's going to stick its head through there again. Because that place has differently textured items. And it knows where I'm at now. Great! Now I'm going to die! Unless this happens. Oh, wait. Spring-loaded and boink! Yes! Got him! Okay, this way. No, I missed a blue stud! Alright, I think I'm going to finish out LEGO Jurassic Park 1 today, just because we got one more level left. I mean, honestly, we do actually have one more level left, so this should be the end. Collect the fifth T-Rex. There's six T-Rex fossil pieces. Oh, no, thank you. Okay, so I need to go down here, and I can break this. Or saw it. At least it's putting that raptor claw to use. Where's your little brother? We could use him for that. And we broke the stairs. Good job, Grant. Our one way out. And you broke it. Uh, the botany thing. So I can use that. And then break this apart. No, wait. Gotta break this. And then we can go botany. There we go. Okay, yeah, that is Ellie. I thought it was the girl. Like, the little girl. Okay, we're going to grow this. And what is that going to do? What did it do? Did it choke him? Um. Oh, I actually can just change into him. Okay, so it's not like you have... It's not like the actual console LEGO games where you have more than one character now. It's actually, you only have two, and then they can just, like, auto-switch. That's handy. Save you the trouble of having to look after four different characters. Yes, run away from the, the Velociraptor. That one was warranted. Alright, break these. Open sesame. And then get whatever this is. A little bridge for Grant to get across. Perfect. No, um, can I switch? There we go. Because I want these coins. Coins equal true survivor. Can the AI pick up coins, or is it just me? 
Because I actually forget if the yeah, I can pick up coins or not. Um, no. Switch to... There we go. Switch to her. And then... Ah, crap. Well, I died. I literally just split into multiple consecutive atoms. Okay. Come on, jump. There we go. That time she made it. Third time's the charm. Right, so we're right above the fossils. And if I'm right, this is where T-Rex comes in. Or, Raptor, not T-Rex. And he's jumping. Great. She's jumped. Dang it. I keep doing that. Well, they got trapped underneath the bones now. No, they didn't. Was that it? Yep. There it is. It's not in the cinematic, though. Get him. Get him, little raptor. Yeah, the big thing is of greater concern to you right now. What are we doing? Oh. I'm the... I'm the raptor right now. I didn't know that. So I'm actually helping the raptor fight the T-Rex. Ow, okay, that's not good. Or no, I am the T-Rex. Okay, I was thinking of Jurassic World, but I'm actually the T-Rex right now. Okay, come on. Uh, Grant, we need you there, buddy. We need you to actually break this open. There we go. The T-Rex still has a lot of health, though. Like, a lot, a lot of health. Okay, he, she's back in action. Yes, go at it. Get him. Get her, T-Rex. Get her done. There we go. And then bite. And it's just tossing it like a football. Okay, I don't have any shoot characters and I saw a target. Crap. Um, can I go this way? Yes. Great. But, wait, am I... Am I actually the girl? I think I might actually be the girl. I didn't know that. No, come on. Break this. Throw it. Throw it at the target over here, then. Since you don't want to hit that other one. Come on, get the reticle on it. And... Got it! And Raptor gets smacked in the head with paint. Alright, another T-Rex time. Oh, Raptor's trying to get smart, is he? Raptor's trying to get smart, is she? Well, guess what? Bite! And bite. There we go. Come on. Break their spine. Break their spine in two. There we go. And here it is. Come on, do the roar. Come on, do the roar. Good call. That line just seems so corny to me. Get her. Get her, little Mrs. T-Rex. There it is. I love the comedy in Lego games, by the way. It's just, it's awesome. Alright, we did it. We did it good. Level complete. True Survivor, didn't get that. Didn't get any fossil pieces, because, let's face it, I didn't have the time to. Alright, so I'm going to return to the hub. Do we get, like, an end credit scene? End credits. Alright, so that was it for this video on Jurassic Park. Next time we'll be moving on to Jurassic Park 2 or Jurassic Park World if you guys want me to continue on with that since we already got a tiny bit into that from the intro to the game. But whatever you guys want to see me do, let me know. I'm not going to go 3 then 2 because if I do end up doing another Jurassic Park game, I'm going to do them in order. So it'll be Jurassic Park, then The Lost World, then Jurassic Park 3. But if you want to see me do Jurassic World then I actually will do that. But anyway, 
that's going to probably be it for this video. I love this game so much. Just To me, LEGO games have always added that kind of comedy to where it's that kind of comedy that works with the kind of genre. That LEGO games aren't that kind of action, kind of really serious kind of style in art or anything else. So they're never really taken that seriously. And the comedy just works with that so well. And I like how in this one, instead of having you control, like, multiple characters, because in the old games, um, well, in the platforms other than this, when you used to have more than one character, like in Marvel Super Heroes on the submarine, when you had Iron Man, Spider-Man, and Thor, it would give you all three characters, but this time, it just gives you two characters, and then you can just randomly switch out between the other ones in your party. So, that's actually cool, I like that. Um, I don't know if I'll get any more dinosaur pieces before the next episode, because I honestly don't know when the ex next episode is going to go up, and I don't know what I'm going to end up doing before that. But I will probably play more of this. I'll definitely play more of this, because I'm not stopping this game anytime soon. But I will definitely play more of this. Um, again, if you guys want to see me do Lost World or Jurassic World, let me know. Um, I'll do whatever one you guys want me to do. But I absolutely love these games. And I love how they're like they're hitting all the cinematic points of the movie just right. That they're still kind of keeping all of the cinematic parts that felt like they should have been cinematics in actual cinematic version. And then all the other games are kind of, or all the other scenes are kind of just like in-game mode. And that was, that used to be a problem with a lot of old games. That when they try to switch from cinematic to um, gameplay, it ended up going really crappy when you got back to gameplay. And then the cinematic was like extremely well done. But this game does that really well in the sense that it doesn't really seem like there's much change. Because when you go from cinematic, it's just like you're watching it at a different angle. And then when you're at gameplay, you're actually looking at it from like a first person angle. But anyway, if I can end these credits. Let me see. Yep, there we go. Ooh, bonus level unlocked. We might have to try that out next time. But anyway, I'm going to leave this episode of LEGO Jurassic Park here. Absolutely love this game. I'm definitely playing more of this. Um, again, just to kind of say it again, just so I know that I said it for sure. Let me know if you guys want to see me do the um, Jurassic World or the Lost World next episode. Um, I might do the bonus episode as a kind of side episode after I finished all the other stories. Like, I'll go back and I'll do all the other bonus episodes um, after I finished out the last actual chapter of the game. But anyway, I'm leaving this video here. If you guys liked it, you can slap the like button as always. And I will see all you beautiful people in the next video.